One man the focus of attention. Three goals in his last three games. He's in sparkling form. We'll have the action on EA TV. And a warm welcome on what is an ideal night for football, you've got to say. I'm Derek Ray, and I'm joined here on the gantry for commentary by Stuart Robson. And we've got potentially exciting league action coming up on the menu for you. It's Maritimo facing Porto. Thanks, Derek, as always. This should be a good game. Great atmosphere inside the stadium. We've got two teams full of quality, some interesting matchups, and two coaches that want to play an attractive brand of football. What more could you ask for? The lineup then for the hosts. Well, it's a 4 3 3 formation with a centre forward and two wingers. So it's important that the midfield players give support to the striker whenever the ball goes wide. They can't allow him to be isolated. Well, here's the starting 11 for Porto. Well, it's the same formation, but they use it to press the ball high up the field. And rarely do the wide players drop deep to defend. And watch out for the midfield three, who continually rotate their positions. And so the match is underway. A bad pass it was. The referee's letting it go as they keep the ball. Well, we know how troublesome he can be on the pitch, but what should we expect from him? Just had to keep his concentration to the maximum, and he did. And over it comes. Cleared away. Dangerous looking attack. Oh, he's left his marker for dead. And a useful cross. And still dangerous. Well, they can bring it out now. Wants to attack from the wide areas. Will he play it in? Still not clear. This looks threatening. Well, spot on with that challenge. Edgar Costa. Well, really rifling that one in, and he didn't miss by much. It might be on for them. Just the clearance that was needed. They've won back possession. Well, the ball lost here. Now well, the keeper should grab hold of it. Easy meet for the goalkeeper. Luis Diaz. And on the ball, Sergio Oliveira. Oh, that's a pass of high quality. Still alive. And that's an excellent piece of defending to thwart him. Doesn't want to give it away here. Clear foul play. And as a result, a free kick forthcoming. And 
he read it well defensively. Tactically quite clear what they're doing, trying to get right on top of their opponents. Ivan Rossi. Zainadine. Here's Edgar Costa. It looks promising. A good and fair challenge. They're really pressing their opponents. Really a very poor ball. Promising attack, this. Well, a really single-minded piece of defending to make sure nothing untoward happened. Losing possession here. A room to roam on the wing. Inside he goes. Oliveira. Oh, a save right out of the top drawer. Super stop. Who can they pick out? That is that for the first half here. Plenty to consider based on what we've seen so far as the second half begins. Well, beating his opponent. Has someone to play it to. Must take the lead here. And they have. You've got to say, it has been coming. Well, let's look at this again. He's done superbly well to pick out a teammate here. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. So the match has restarted. 1-0 here. This attack looks highly promising. Chance to play it in. Well, the crossing needs to be a bit better than that. No mistake from the keeper. Will it be punished? Tremendous block. He'll be delighted to have won the ball, having made that difficult challenge. Can they hit on the break? And the big news confirmed. Manchester United have succeeded in getting their man, Stuart. Well, it's an exciting transfer, isn't it? He'll add a lot of quality to his new club, and you'd expect him to have an impact straight away. Good player and fair value for him, I think. Plenty of options. This looks promising. Oh, surely! And they've done it to square the game once again. Exhilarating. Well, let's look at this again, Derek, because the transition when the ball changes hands is so quick. And there, he never looked like missing. That's a lovely goal. So, a level contest. 1-1. Too much pace on that particular pass. So a goal kick is what's coming up here. He's enjoying space. Oh, that's a fine cross. Oh, that is a majestic goal! Volleyed home! Precision and style, superbly done. Well, here's the replay, and it's a really inviting ball played into the box, begging players to attack it, and he makes no mistake with the finish. He showed a lot of composure there. Now, as they kick off again, 2-1, the current state of affairs. <laughs> Running with the ball confidently. Safe pair of hands, did his job. Adama, and the cross goes in. What a save! Zainadine. Well, just listen to the atmosphere in here. The fans doing every bit to try and spur their team on for this equaliser.
Oliver grabs off the keeper. Well, no damage done. Well, that was a great save. But the way they're playing at the moment, the equaliser can't be far away now. Cross could be useful. Well, I suspected that might be difficult for the keeper, but I was wrong. Now we're inside the final 10 minutes in this one. Good pressure high up the pitch. Well, that's how to break the spirit of the attacker. Pressing high, and they have the ball again. Losing possession a bit easily. And the counter looks on here. Options of... In with a chance. It's still alive. Danger averted for now. Well, that save has just about kept them in it. But they have to pose more of a threat at the other end. Well, time is against them. They have work to do. Now, will the cross work out for them? Not messing around with that clearance. And there it is, the full-time whistle here, and it's a victory for the visitors. Well, Derek, it was a really tight game, but they were the better side over the 90 minutes, and they fully deserved their victory today. On a standout performance, not for the first...
And good evening on what is a perfect night for football. The floodlights shining down on the players as we speak. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, and ready to provide expert analysis. Alongside me is Stuart Robson. And we've got what we hope will be exciting league action coming up for you. Stuart, what are you expecting to see? Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins those battles will win the game. Great opportunity, and just narrowly wide. Well, it's a good effort from that range, but I think the keeper had it covered. Now, what can they do from here? Teammates in the middle. Not really the ideal clearance. And Grujic. Very alert defending to put a stop to the chance. Well, he always has to be regarded as a dangerous opponent. So what should we expect to see from him in this game, Stuart? Well, Derek, when he's on form, when he's focused, he's a brilliant runner with the ball. He can take on players. He can go past people with ease. And he's got a great shot on him as well. I'm really looking forward to watching him play today. Decent cross, but nobody in the vicinity. Makes the move to the inside. And getting across to stop it. Who's going to get on the end of it? And it goes! Well, the pressure has been mounting, and now they have the lead! Well, here it is again. It's a good delivery from the corner, and then what a great finish as well. Good connection with the ball, leaving the keeper with little chance. It's a great goal. And the ball moving again. What sort of response will we see from them now? Oh, great vision. Committed challenge. This looks promising. Now he must favour the cross. The clearance wasn't decisive. Danger averted for now. Good pressure to win the ball back high up the pitch. Thiago Esgallo. And the counter-attack is on. Options available. It's been aimed towards the front first. Well, they can't quite take advantage in the end. And pull back. And he takes on the shot. A gift for any goalkeeper. Fabio Cardoso. Having won the ball back, they might be able to profit. Well, time just challenged magnificently. Nice and easy for the keeper. Well, not quite what he wanted to do with the pass. Not much defensive cover there on the flank. Now, will the cross work out for them? He certainly has time. And not quite on the target. Intelligent threaded pass here. Corner conceded. It came off the defender.
Well, very close to half-time now, and it's a narrow lead for the home side. Stuart, how would you assess what you've seen? Well, it's been a tight game so far, but they've just had that little bit more quality on the ball, particularly in midfield, where they've just started to take control. Oh, they could put it away, Stuart. And a goal to really bolster things for them. Two in front. Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace in transition. They're so quick to get out from the back. And once he gets onto it, he just smashes it past the keeper with great technique. What an emphatic finish that is. Well, a second goal for them here. And with that, the first half draws to it. The teams are ready to have a go at each other again as the second half commences. And he was in the right place to intercept. And no nonsense defensive clearance. That's how to blunt the edge of the opposing attack. Takes it on. Oh, really good reflexes and danger averted. Playing it in. Well, it was never really going to be of concern to the keeper, that one. Well, there's been so much talk about a potential transfer, but it's potential no more. It's fact. Well, I think he's still got a few years left in him. He still looks fit and sharp and still has that desire. What a good signing this could be. Sliding in, winning the ball, and what's more, they've kept it. Getting forward. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Has eyes for goal. And foul it is then. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready, and now they will make the personnel change. Can they cover up? Well, they can keep possession now. Now, what can they do from here? Could reduce the deficit. Chance, maybe. Oh, the goalkeeper got there in the end. Well, his recovery is brilliant here. So athletic. Well, those stats confirm it. Porto have enjoyed the majority of the possession. They've passed it well, their movement's been good, and they've been well worth their lead. Could get even better here. And it was pretty straightforward for the goalkeeper. It is a decent looking attack here. And winning it back. Well, that is how to play advantage. Well, he's gone back and awarded the free kick because there really wasn't much of a tangible advantage. And the yellow card for that, Stuart. And he's going to have to be careful now. That was a silly challenge. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Throw-ins given. And into the last 15 minutes of action. Great reflex action. Well, that should have been a goal. Mind you, it's a brilliant save. And there's the delivery. Still not clear. Well, this would help them get back into the game. And never in any doubt from the keeper. Beautifully disguised ball. Giving the ball away. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack?
Well, it wasn't the best piece of finishing, in all honesty. Goal kick. Yeah, it was all good until that final effort. Just shows you how devastating they can be on the break, though. So a personnel change then. And out of play, the pass nearly worked out, but not quite. Well, it comes down to the final five minutes. Grujic. The ball with Ottavio. Looks as though he's alone in the centre. Well, the keeper performing brilliantly. Well, that's just incredible. He reacted so quickly there. Well, totalling up all the stoppages, we'll have two additional minutes. An incisive pass. And a goal to put the final stamp on it. That will do it. Well, as you can see, it was a fairly simple finish in the end. But you still have to be in the right place. Keep your composure and finish it off. And that's exactly what they did. The referee blows for full time, it ends a victory for the home team, no complaints from the fans here. Well Derek, they were the better team. Some questions regarding the match. That'll be all, thank you.